Are you ready? Yeah! I want to know, is everybody ready? Yeah! All right, here we go. Hey now. Yeah! 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 Bobby back! From Indifference is doing it. And as usual, as you can tell, my stoke level is dialed up really high right now, but it's for good reason this time. It is because today we are unveiling a brand new series on these T Diddy Airways. A series that is 100% created and curated by all of you nutbags out there who decided to follow our little Cree and decided, you know what? That old man Coppers, I think he's right. The difference, it really is just doing it. And then you grabbed all your discs and a bunch of dyes and like a whole buttload of lotion and glue and shaving cream, and then just jumped into the wormhole right behind us. Nutbags, okay. <laughs> Nutbags, but my kind of people. A couple years back, I put out a call to all of these crazies in the TD the Army and, and, and asked them to start sharing their disc dying journey and creations with all the rest of us by tagging anything that they post on the interweb with hashtag T to the army. Really, it was just the best that old high tech Bobby could come up with at the time. But, you know, after just a couple years of that time ticking by, that hashtag T to the army on Instagram is now quickly approaching 10 thousand posts which come on that is a lot of doing it and as you're about to see in just a minute here doing it well you know it really is just a bottomless well of killer ideas and disc dies for that matter that frankly has become my own personal primary source of inspiration it never takes more than just a minute or two of scrolling to fill my tank right up with just what I need to start to bang, which eventually, you know, it all got me to thinking, we need to squeeze as much juice as we can out of this resource. So I got to talking with my main man, X to the Z, and we came up with this idea, really he came up <laughs> with this idea of like a massive slideshow with some real hot beats behind him that we can use to put on in the background while we're disc dying. Yeah. And then like you'll have all of the hot beats you need to keep you going while you're doing your thing over the turntable. And then like, if at any point along the way, you need like a little shot of the old Inspirado, it's already up there on the screen for you, just scrolling by hot T to the army disc dies. So with almost 10,000 posts to work with, look, I've got a lot of fodder to make this series run for a long time, if you boys and girls are into it. J just to get started, I downloaded pictures from all the posts from 2021, which equated to well over 6,500 TDD Army disc dies, <clears throat> which at four seconds a piece, I was able to squeeze 900 of them <laughs> into this first episode, this first one hour episode of our attempt to DJ your disc dying sessions with some hot beats and some even hotter plastic. <sighs> I went with a liquid drum and bass set for the beats this time, which I hope you all can dig. Look, if I had my way, it would be all James Brown and Stevie Wonder and Bobby Bird just funking up your disc dice. <laughs> funking it right up. But like, I have to do the copyright dance with all this as well. And it's a lot of music. So nonetheless, I will be mixing up the genres over future episodes of this series. So, you know, if there's something that really gets your juices going, don't be afraid to let me know down in the comments and I'll try to mix it in. Like, wiggity, wiggity, wiggity. Okay, that is more than enough talking about it. It is time to start this party and let you kids get on to doing it. Now, don't forget, keep tagging your stuff with hashtag T to the Army when you post it all over the interweb. I'll get the vacuum sucker working and you are more than likely to catch it on a future episode here on these T to the Airwaves. All right, happy disc dying. And until we catch you on the next one, you better keep doing it. Yeah!